y'all, my teammates are killing me. <laughs> Everybody's patience might be getting short. <laughs> Teresa and Eddie, they they looked like they was ready to have a cat fight. <laughs> and it was Oops. so funny. Well, it was funny. Y'all were playing, but it was still funny. Y'all made me laugh. So, in 1989, when I started the bag lady, every day I made a special dessert that appeared to be everybody's favorite. And that was gooey butter cakes. Well, I made those gooey butter cakes every day. We started on June the 19th. I made vanilla gooey butter cakes every day. And when October the 1st came around, I said, uh, y'all hear those funny noises. It's not anybody breaking wind. It's, <laughs> it's Teresa over here using a turkey baster making those sounds. <laughs> I'm be I'm prepping. I'm prepping for the next one. Well, it sounds like you're over there doing something else. I thought you were going to say it was the So, clothes. anyway, when October came around, y'all, I said, if I don't change these gooey butter cakes up, I'm going to scream. So, it was October. It was time to start cooking with pumpkins. So, I formulated it uh, to make the pumpkin gooey butter cake, and I promise you, that has been one of the country's favorites. Sweet potato too. Yeah, sweet potato, oh my gosh, it's so good. So I'm gonna show y'all how I made that very first gooey butter cake on June the 19th, 1989. And we're gonna start with just a, a yellow cake mix, or white, if you got white, that's fine. All right, I'm gonna add one egg and one stick of melted butter. And this is gonna be the base to our gooey butter cake. Now I just take my mixer and uh, it's gonna be real thick, but I just take my mixer and I mix it the best I can until it kind of all gets moistened, just like this. Oh yeah, it's doing good. So over the years, I, I swear, I bet between me and my team, over the years have probably formulated, I bet 50 or 75 different ways to make gooey butter cakes. I am not kidding you. Uh, because we get tired of making the same old ones. All right, now it's just slinging that dough out of there. Oh, um, cause we'd get tired and we'd want to do something new. So we had fun and I'm hoping that you have fun with it too. Uh, this is just the very basic, but you know what? After all these years, it may still be my favorite one. I'm gonna spray that just a little bit, just to ensure, but this has got so much butter in, I probably won't, uh, I have to worry about it sticking, but just out of habit. All right, so I'm gonna take my hands and just spread this out as evenly as I can and up the sides a little bit. Oh my gosh, does this bring back all kind of memories. Mm-mm-mm. That bag lady, it was a phenomenal little business. It, it uh, gave my sons and myself wings, which was just wonderful, only in America. All right, so I got my base spread out right, right nice and even, easy, even. Just like that. All right, so now I'm gonna make the custard part. And I'm gonna start with an eight ounce package of cream cheese. And let's see, that's my melted butter. So I think I'm just gonna whip this first and get it kind of fluffy. Uh-oh, I'm slinging cream cheese all over the place. 
All right, I'm gonna lower that so it'll just barely mix it. All right. I'm gonna add a teaspoon of vanilla. I'm gonna add two eggs. Once in a while, it depends on which gooey butter cake I'm making, but once in a while, like the pumpkin gooey butter cake, I'll add three eggs at this point, but only two is, is really necessary. All right, now I'm gonna add two cups of powdered sugar. And that's where we're gonna get our sweet from. I'm gonna slowly add that butter because I don't want to sling it all over me. And that's about the only reason I'm adding it slow. Is so it won't do that to me. And I ain't leaving none of that butter in there, y'all. <laughs> okay. Okay. Bachelor. I tell you what, with this recipe, uh -huh. when we used to work at the, I mean, we were in the lady houses uh -huh. all the time, it didn't matter. This, you never get tired of eating these. No. Like, that's the saddest thing. I mean, like, not sad, but you know what I mean? I Because I was big as a house by the time we left there. Oh, no. You, I know you probably weighed all of 128 pounds. Yeah. No, not after I Big as there. a house. I wouldn't need to come out in public if I was her. <laughs> This is a dessert no one gets fired. No, everybody loves it. And this has become our signature. And people know when they come into Paula Dean Family Kitchen or, or the Lady and Sons or Creek House, they know that they are going to be offered gooey butter cake. All right, so I'm just going to beat that a little bit more to get the lumps out of it. Powdered sugar want to lump on you. All righty. And you notice I didn't even wash my bowl or the beaters because it's all going in the same pot. So you don't even have to stop and wash. All right. I am going to do one extra little thing. <clears throat> If I can, I'm a coming. I really am a coming. What are you looking for? I am looking for my pecans. They were right on the top. Well, that's what I thought, but I sure don't see them. So maybe look, but you oh, me come on. Y'all, oh. I'm so blind. Oh, I'll fix, I'll get them chopped in just a second. I'm fixing a chop. Fixing chop them, y'all. How you like my chopper? I'm definitely from the school of make do, y'all. All right, I just love nuts. I just love nuts. So I'm adding smashed up pecans to mine but you don't have to have them. It's all about what you like, what your tongue likes. Okay. Michael? Uh-huh. I'm putting nuts in these gooeys. Oh, good, he loves nuts. I guess that's why we get along. We both like nuts. All right, so I'm gonna pour this on. Huh? That was one of my strong attractions to you. <laughs> I don't know if y'all heard him, but he said that was one reason for his strong attraction to me. Was he liked nuts. <laughs> <laughs> he 
Go back to cooking your meat. He's cooking a, a Boston butt on his grill out there. All right, Michael's favorite gooey butter cake. I, had, I don't know if I've ever talked about this, but his favorite is banana gooey butter cake. I make it just like this. I, I mash up, depending on how big the bananas are, a couple of bananas. Just squish it up, you know, put it in the filling. Here is the most important part now about this recipe. It's super simple. You can't mess it up until you go to cook it. And uh, I know the name of this is gooey butter cake, but it's really not a cake. Uh, when you're baking a cake, you want it to be done. When you stick a, a toothpick in the center, you want it to come out clean. Well, this is not, <laughs> oh, look, two of my little grandchildren and Michelle, our daughter. Hey, boys, come over here and get them, Eddie. Can you get them? Leave the door shut, boys. I love y'all so much. Look at them, Eddie. Kiss y'all's heads off. So we're still honoring the quarantine around here, y'all. Um, they're gonna stay six feet away from each other. Try, that may be hard for green daddies to do. Uh, but Michelle is wanting to make sure that her daddy and I stay safe and we're not exposed to anything. So, all right, so back to the cooking of this. Um, you really gonna have to watch it because you know your oven, uh, unless you've calibrated your oven by putting a thermometer in there and setting it to 350 and uh, then checking your thermometer to see where where it measures up to. Uh, but anyway, we're gonna cook this for 40 to 50 minutes. But when you, when at the end of 40 minutes, you wanna do your pan like this and you want it to jiggle just a little bit there in the center. So don't overcook it, cause you want the jiggle. So, okay, 40 minutes. Actually, I'm gonna look at it at 35. I'm sorry, I couldn't wait for y'all. I had to go ahead and start tasting it. I love a gooey butter cake. Mm, mm, mm. I cook this for 40 minutes, y'all. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, I meant to tell y'all. If you don't want to fool with making it from scratch, you can find these at where Paula Dean Stowell. Mm -hmm. Paula Dean .com. PaulaDean.com if you want a little help from your friends. <laughs> mm, and if you come up with some, well, a different one, let me know. Mm, 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 them nuts make it so good. <laughs>